Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Alan Anthony from Phone Tech at Work and today we're going to do the initial setup for your Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3 as soon as you power it on straight out the box. So let's start the video and show you what I'm talking about. Power. Alright guys, so you're going to start off with the language. You guys can choose your language. I'm in America, so I use the English. Um, you can agree to your terms. You don't have to agree to all of them, just to the top two. All right, so I already signed on my Wi-Fi, and it's gonna ask you whether or not you wanna copy your apps or your data. So I'm going with don't copy, so we can have a fresh install, and you have to sign into your Google account. If you don't have a Google account, you can create one right over there. If you guys are coming from Apple, you can hit skip and you can do that later by the way so you can check out your phone you can enjoy it uh, Google services you can either turn that off or on all right if you have a Samsung account you can set that up as well all right so you can do it like that taking care of your phone so you can actually set up your fingerprint scanner which I actually did but but then I had a problem with my uh, phone so I can actually show you guys that as soon as it loads up okay so if you want to set up your fingerprint scanner like it does in the initial setup you just got to go through your biometrics and you can set up your fingerprint or your face unlock it's basically like face ID for iPhone so I actually added a pin first um, I picked a simple pin so I can remember and then when you do your fingerprint scanner you just have to go up and down right in that little sensor right below the volume down button just go up and down up and down up and down you don't even have to look at it just go up and down with your thumb or whatever finger you want to do it and you can actually add another fingerprint but I'm gonna go with that alright so let's get back here so these are the apps that actually come pre-installed with the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3 as you guys can see there's a whole bunch of Google apps a whole bunch of Microsoft apps all right, and you have a whole bunch of Samsung apps which actually help and uh, you have your Play Store and all that stuff so if you do want to download apps from the Play Store you do have to have a Google account and if you want to download apps from the Samsung Store you do have to have a Samsung account as well so let's get right into the settings let's see exactly what actually comes as far as storage uh, let's check the storage this is the 512 model let's see if we have an update first all right, let's check it for updates. We are up to date. We are on the July 1st security patch. You can check the battery. So straight out the box with the unlock model, you do have the storage. It actually using 56 gigs out the box. This is the 512 model and it has over 12 gigabytes of RAM as well. And it's using 3.7 gigs right now. So that's pretty, that's okay. You do have a lot of storage left. So it's using 11% out the box. Let's lower down this brightness so you guys can see it a little bit more. All right, this is what you get on your home toggles right here. You have a whole bunch of different modes here. Um, if you guys want to see a video on that, just let me know down in the comments. Um, let's go into wallpapers. Let's see what type of wallpapers actually come with this. They always have some really, really cool looking wallpapers for the fold. So these are what they look like I'm not sure if I could just look at them well let's see if we could turn it sideways maybe it's a little bigger uh, no. alright so it's the same so you could pick either downloaded ones uh, you got this one right here so you can put it for your lock screen the home screen or for both which is uh, pretty cool here so that's about it guys when it comes to the initial setup it's pretty simple I didn't want to make this video super long so I made it just under five minutes and as you guys can see it is still installing apps this is a fresh install with no Google Apps but that's about it for right now so if you guys like this video hit it with a thumbs up I did it for the people who have never had an Android device or have never had a fold and this is exactly what to expect so if you guys like this video hit it with a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and you can access everything from here as well if you guys like this video one more time hit with a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already 
and follow phone tech at work for more videos like this of the samsung galaxy z fold 3 and more tech to come peace and love i'll see you guys in the next video and set up your weather too peace and love i'll see you guys in the next one later